Hello everyone, I welcome you to my channel. Today I am going to show you how to install the latest version of NetBeans IDE which is NetBeans IDE 16 on a Windows operating system. So let's begin. Now to install NetBeans IDE it is very important to install Java first. So in my previous video I have already showed you how to install the latest version of Java which is Java 19 on a Windows operating system. So it is very important to install Java before installing NetBeans IDE. So do you follow that video and install your Java on your system and then again come back to this video for installing NetBeans IDE. Okay, I will be putting the link in the description. So now that your Java is rightly installed, it's time to install our NetBeans IDE. So for that you need to first simply go to your favorite browser in the address bar, just simply type NetBeans download and hit enter and you will get this www.netbeans.apache.org as our first search result. So here you need to just simply click on Apache NetBeans releases and this will going to redirect you to the official site of Apache NetBeans and here you can see that our latest version of Apache NetBeans IDE is NetBeans 16 ok and our see we have a download button. So just simply click on that download button and it will go to redirect to this downloading Apache NetBeans 16 page. So depending upon what operating system you are using, Windows, Mac OS or Linux or any other operating system you are using. So you need to proceed with those links. For Windows you need to just simply click on this link and it will go to redirect to this Apache you know software foundation page. So here you can see we have this link for you know Windows installation. So just simply click on that link and it will going to start downloading our Apache NetBeans. Now since I have already downloaded it, I just simply cancel it. I will just simply minimize my browser and if I go to my download directory, you can see that our Apache NetBeans ID 16 is already been downloaded over here. Now to install, you need to just simply double click on that installer and it will ask you for administrative privileges. Just simply click on yes and you can see that it is rightly started configuring the installer. So you can minimize our you know download directory and uh, you can see that our NetBeans you know started configuring the installer. So these are you know the base ID Java, Java E, then HTML5, JavaScript and PHP. So these are all you can use with NetBeans. So you can also customize if you wish like if you don't want to use php or html you can just simply uncheck this i'll keep everything as a default and click on you know next so, and uh, these are the license agreement you can always read this and accept this license agreement and click on next so this is where you know our netbeans is going to be installed and as i said in uh, the starting of the video like it is very important to install java so you can see that in that video i have showed you that I have installed Java on this program files Java JDK 19 folder path. So it has you know rightly recognized that if you haven't installed Java then it will you know show some error message over here. So it's better to install Java before you know installing NetBeans. Okay. So since it's installed on, on my machine it has rightly recognized that path. So I will just simply click on next and uh, check for updates is fine so it is going to install our netbeans 16 total installation size is 801.9 mb so that much amount of free space is required on your c drive which you should be having okay so other things are fine just simply click on install and there you go our installation has rightly began so you can you know wait for uh, you know couple of minutes to get it finished so i'll be also doing the same and come back once this gets completed So welcome back and now you can clearly see that our NetBeans IDE is rightly installed. So installation completed successfully. So you can just simply click on finish. So this is our desktop shortcut. So you can just simply double click on the Apache NetBeans IDE 16 to launch our you know IDE. So you can see that our Apache NetBeans IDE is rightly started launching. And it has rightly launched. So let's you know maximize it. And you can see this is the interface of our Apache NetBeans ID 16. So you can close this and you'll get this you know project uh, uh, window on the left side. 
so i'll be showing you how to create a new project so for that first go to file and then click on new project and here you can see that we have several categories so java with maybe in gradle and and you know several projects are there i am going to show you a simple you know java project with uh, you know application so java with and i am going to choose and here going to be java application and then just simply click on next and uh, you know give some time to find the feature so it is currently activating our java ac so you know give some time to activate our java ac so our java ac is rightly activated and it is asking to give you know you know our project name so let's give the project name as a hello world okay i'll keep this simple and here you know is our uh, project location so they're going to create netbeans project folder and there they're going to create our project name hello world okay and uh, they're also going to create our main class so which will be hello world dot hello world so hello world is our project our you know package and this is our class okay so let's you know click on finish and it will you can see that it is you know rightly started creating our new project so you know again let's wait for some time to create our project and there we go see our project is rightly created over here hello world you can uh, you know click on this drop down you can see the source packages then libraries so you can click on this drop down for our package hello world and if you click on this drop down you can see our class hello world dot java okay so this file is rightly opened over here so it has also created our main method so i can just simply you know hit and enter and just type system dot out dot println and i am going to print a simple hello world over here okay so i'm just going to end this with semicolon and i'm going to click on this run button and you can see here it started to run our project and it's you can see build is successful and our output hello world is also shown in our console so in this way you can easily install latest version of netbeans ide on a windows operating system in my previous videos i have also shown you how to install intel ige idea and eclipse ide so do install eclipse ide and intel ige idea and also start practicing your java projects on those ides so thank you very much for watching this video and god bless you all